Hi, I'm Erock, Program Director for the Tough Mudder Boot Camp. We have an eight minute agility workout for Tough Mudder obstacles. We've broken it down into four easy to follow sets. Let's get to it. This first set begins with 30 seconds of jumping jacks. Let's begin in three, two, one, go. Up and down, we're gonna get the heart rate up. We're gonna take our body through its full range of motion. Now, we wanna start thinking about agility even now. Quick toes touching out and then right back in. Fingertips can touch over the top and then pulling right back underneath. We're only going for 30 seconds at each of these movements. You'll get a 30 second break after each progression, after each set. Here we go for 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Keep those feet out nice and wide, arms out stretched, windmill toe touches. Same thing, hinging at the waist, Quick reaction back to the top. If you want to, you can scale up to a little jump at the bottom. So up and over, up and over. You can activate that posterior, driving off those toes back to the top. We're working for 10 more seconds, keeping it rolling. Four, three, two, one. Bring your feet in, walk your hands out to a push-up position. Dropping to chest down to the floor, keeping the shoulders in front of the fingertips to allow that wrist to stay right underneath the elbow. Let's look at some repetitions. Both Kendall and Carla are dropping to their knees, keeping the back nice and flat, but not sacrificing that range of motion. You can do this for five more seconds. We've got a break coming up. Here we go, ladies. Three, two, one, and stand. 30 second rest time, shake it off. 90 seconds of work, not too bad. Once again, you get to set the intensity here. All we're working is that agility, body weight movement only, you can do it. We're gonna start with our next lower body agility piece, high knees in 10 seconds. Get that breath, get your body about you, because we're gonna get this thing going in three, two, one, and move. Pulling those knees up nice and high, once again, Thinking about agility, we'll want to think about quick toe touches off the floor, pulling our knees high above 90. Core stays nice and tight. Arms are moving back and forth through that shoulder. Don't just move through the elbow. Keep it moving. Here we go. Come on. 10 seconds. We're going to go into some lateral high knees. Now, challenging your movement. Here we go. Two, one, and go. High steps. Moving. High steps, moving, there we go. Good stuff, guys. That's it, pull it up, quick toe touches. Use the arms to keep the core engaged. 10 seconds remaining, you've got it. Driving high off the ground, pulling and pushing with those arms. You've got it for five, four, three, two, one. Let's add the burpee, y'all, you ready? Here we go, down and up. High knees over to the side, down and up. Perfect, now notice the gals behind me as we look at their reps. Kendall using more of that piked position there, planked position, that's what we want for 10 more seconds. You guys doing good? I'm jumping back in, here we go. Let's move for five, four, three, two, one, and rest. You guys get 30 seconds to gather yourself. We're huffing and puffing already. How you feeling? Ooh. Feel good? Oh, yeah. <laughs> awesome, they're getting a great workout just as you are as well. Now we're going into those standing toe touches next. 10 seconds. We're gonna get the core tight. We're gonna hinge at the waist. Let's find that balance. Here we go. I want you in three, two, one. Dig your left in, foot in the ground, reach down. Keep the foot that's swinging internally rotated, keeping the pelvis squared, reaching back, stretching long. So much of agility is about balance and coordination. You guys can do this with this simple movement, the standing toe touch. The more you reach back with your back foot, the easier it is for your core and your shoulders to stay right over the top of the foot and stay engaged. Three, two, one, reverse lunges are next. Stepping back and forward. We're gonna alternate as 
we've done with the standing toe touches. You're gonna find that balance through the foot, keeping the knee over the top of the ankle, chest up nice and tall. And you know where we're going next. We're going explosive. So I hope you guys are ready for 10 more seconds. Now, if you wanna scale up, simply put, what we can do is just add a little jump to these reverse lunges, making them nice and hard. Last movement now, guys. We're going high skips, you ready? Lunging back and forward, back and forward. We're gonna do three and then switch legs. Here we go, back and forward, back and forward and up. Nice, there we go. Down and up. Beautiful. Five, four, three, two, one. Wow, that one got my quads going. That's good stuff right there. We've got one more set. You guys can stick with us. We're building that agility to keep us successful on the Tough Mudder course at any obstacle that life may throw at us. Here we go. We've got 10 seconds left. I'm getting that sweat on already. I don't know about you guys. We're going planked, shoulder taps. It's all about core. It's all about the upper body. Three, two, one. Plank position. Down here on the ground, spread those feet and begin to touch. Now, notice, staying rock solid means the core stays engaged, means that the feet stay a little bit wider. We want those hips to not rotate too much, creating a lot of sway. Keep everything organized nice and tight. Now, for an added challenge, make sure that those hands are staying under the shoulders for five, four, three, two, one. Keep it in that plank position. Move your feet in. Let's go mountain climbers. Pull them up. As with all agility, keep those feet moving nice and fast. As soon as those toe touches the floor, you're pulling that knee back up underneath you. There we go. I'm feeling this. How about you guys? <laughs> We've got 10 seconds. Keep working. Keep working. It's agility, but it's also a little bit of cardio. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Tuck jumps are the last movement right here. We're gonna get into a quarter squat. Big jump and pull. Beautiful. Load and explode. Drive and pull. Drive and pull. Here we go. Good. Make sure you're loading. Hips back, hamstrings engaged. You got this. Here we go for 10. And five, four, three, two, one. And that is it. That is all. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe to the channel, watch more videos, and comment below. And we'll see you at a Tough Mudder soon.